I am strong. I am powerful. Each day, in every way, I am at one with the ever-loving energy of the universe. I make commitments. I succeed because I deserve to succeed. I am worthy of all that the universe provides. I am safe. I am safe because I am worthy of safety. To heal is to change. To change is to risk. I take risks. I take risks because I am in control. I am perfect. I attract perfection. I am an extension of a great and majestic source of eternally loving energy. I am magnetic. Others sense my perfection. When I enter a room, all eyes are drawn to me because I am worthy of praise. With each passing moment, I become closer to actualizing all that is perfect inside of me. I do not worry. Feelings are merely perceptions. Perceptions are choices. Therefore, every feeling is a choice. I choose love. The world is an intensely pleasant place. I am complete. All of the wisdom of... I was, uh, just having pie at this mom and pa dive. Everyone there was hollering and squawking about the disappearances. Did you know people vanished tonight? Five of them. Right along this road. The place was creeping with flies. They, uh, they kept landing on my pie, so I had to go. You, uh, they were looking flies. They're different. Some have, uh, Shiny little coats, yellow or green, usually. And one day I, I got to wondering if there was something on the inside that made one stronger than the other. So I, I took a yellow fly, and I took a green fly, and I laid each one of them in a little drop of glue. And then I pulled them apart. Slowly, first the wings, then the legs, and then I got down real close and I pulled out the eyes. You ever see a fly pickling like that? They don't look like anything at all, just little black dots squirming. The yellow one died right away, but green one, you went on all night, writhing, kicking limbs that weren't even there anymore, I could feel it pleading, you know what I learned that day, under the right set of circumstances, Even a fly would beg for death. Well, fuck. I finally get some control over my life. I finally find the courage to regard myself as a strong and worthy human being. And then what do I do? I drive down a dark, deserted road, and I offer a ride to Jeffrey fucking Dahmer. <sighs> I bring the shit on myself. Uh, I, I ain't no maniac. Really? Then what was all that fly mangling business? Because that is one fucked up icebreaker. All I was doing was trying to tell you a story. No you, don't, no, you don't fool me. Look at you, sitting there with your bag of 
fish hooks and, and speculums and Christ knows what other flesh-tangling monstrosities. Look at you! <laughs> Homicidal fuck! What's your name? Steve. Did you know that every man in the world wants to drink my blood? They smile like a sweet, hairy fools, but I hear them. I hear their minds conspiring little whispers, discussing how pretty I would look if, if I were pale and silent and gutted. Can you explain that to me, Steve? Arching gently across the sky, my soul is aglow with beams of beautiful healing light. The light is joy. I accept this joy. I smile. I smile because I fully accept that my life is a frantic medley of joy and abundance, teeming with emotionally satisfying experiences. I am triumph personified. Every day, in every way, I move closer to my ideal image. My body is lean. My body is strong. I am a vastly wondrous being. There is only one me. <laughs>